Joel, Samantha, pleased to have you back on fan cams. How does it feel to be back in Oakwell? Massive, absolutely massive, mate. It's great to be back. The atmosphere are electric today. It's been far too long, mate. This is where football belongs. This is what it should be. It feels nice to be back to normal and not sat at home watching it. Well, we sat and watched semi-final second leg, didn't we? Um, and obviously, it we're gutted. We were all gutted when we went out. But today, it's a, it feels a lot different today, doesn't it? Yeah. It does, definitely. Um, this is what football's all about, fans. Um, fans being in ground, creating the atmosphere, getting players on. And we've got a win today, so can't yeah. complain. Yeah. Even down to hearing all chants and music are beginning, we're good. Yeah. Time Rider comes on, air stick up on back of your neck. Yeah, it's, it sends a tingle down your spine. I said to Sammy coming in, I said, that one of the things we're looking forward to hearing that play and watching players come out and everybody, everybody standing. and Just just fantastic, mate. Fantastic all day. Yeah. Uh, what do you think this season? Uh, what your hopes for this season? Obviously, I don't. Do you think we'll rep replicate what we did last season, or would you take? I mean, I think we'll all take mid-table again, won't we? I'm hoping that they're not under pressure with fans watching them mainly. Yeah, I'm gonna say with fans back. Do you think? I've, I mean, obviously, do you think that had an effect last season? We discussed it a lot, didn't we? On Zoom interviews, which I'm so glad we're not going to be doing many of them anymore. <laughs> End of the day, I think fa fans are part of football, the fabric of any club. I think if you can't. As a player, if you can't get up for days and occasions like this, you don't need to be playing in the first place. Um, so there's two ways it can go. It can either can either put pressure on or, it, or you can thrive on it. Players can thrive on it and hopefully we do this season. I'd take top 10, to be fair. Um, I'd be happy with that. I'd be happy with top 10. I mean, obviously it all depends. Do you think there'll see it be any more signings come in? Do you think we need any more on today's performance? Uh, um. We weren't very good with defending, were we? I thought defending were all right. It's attack, it's attack more than anything. Yeah. When Morris went off, you could tell, couldn't you? When Adua, uh, when uh, Adua came on, it, um, it did seem to take a while to get going. Yeah, I thought first half we, I thought to be fair, up to the first goal, I thought they they probably edged it. Yeah. They, were, they had one off at bar. They had a couple of chances, yeah. and we had a couple. Um, I think second half were a bit flat, flat from our point of view. Yeah. Uh, I thought passing were a bit, especially final third were a bit iffy all over the place. But we ground it out. We got the win. Uh, fantastic save from Collins. Shout out to him. Absolutely, absolutely mega. Um, saved us three points today. So big up to him as well. It seems yeah. to take a long time to get that goal as well. Mm. It took a while coming, didn't it? But one nil, we'll take it any day, won't we? Four points out of six. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, I'll definitely check it. Uh, I think going forward, I think we need to be, probably need to be a bit more clinical in and around final third. Yeah. That's my only concern at the minute. Um, defensively, we look pretty solid. Um, i say having fans back, I think, really helped today. Uh, defensively, we're solid. I think it's just, it's just been a bit more clinical in and around final third. But we've got to win. Uh, sometimes you've got to grind them out. We did. Uh, we'd have lost those at times. So you've got to check it. And we move on. On to Luton. Certainly do, mate. Nice one.